Am I the asshole? For calling my boyfriend's little sister racist because she likes gay pop. For background my parents and I F21 moved from South Korea to America when I was 13. Both my parents are Korean too. My boyfriend M22 and I have been dating for 6 months. We go to college together, my family lives in the same city that our college is, his family however lives in another city so I haven't had the chance to meet them until now. His parents invited us to spend the weekend over at their house so they can meet me, up until now um, I have only spoke a few times on the phone with his parents but not with his siblings. He has three siblings. An older brother, sister and brother. The problem with his sister is that apparently she's a K-pop fan. My boyfriend had already told me this prior to meeting her and he told me to get ready. I thought that meant that she would ask me to say something in Korean or something like that it has happened to me before even by strangers in the street, it's annoying. Well, first things first she greeted me with an hello in Korean, I faked a laugh and greeted her too. It wouldn't have been such a deal if that was it, but then she continued calling me unni and asking me if I called my boyfriend opa and such things. She then started asking where did I live when I was in Korea, if I had met any idols, if I ever tried to be an idol myself, etc. She insisted on sitting next to me and she was taking photos of me eating because I looked like an idol. Like, what does that even mean? I'm just trying to eat, her mother had to tell her to stop because I was very visibly uncomfortable. After eating she wanted me to go dance some K-pop choreographies with her because you know, every Korean knows how to dance I guess. We stayed there over the weekend so it was two days of not stop of this kind of behavior. I was so glad when it was time to leave. As soon as we pulled out the driveway I told my boyfriend you were not kidding, your sister is worse than I imagined he laughed and said it was expected of her to act like this. So I told him so she's always this racist huh? He took offense on that, he told me that his sister wasn't racist at all, she was only excited to meet me. I said that all she did during our visit was to make assumptions about me and talk to me in a racist way like come on, calling me unni when she doesn't even know the context of the word has to be racist for Americans too right? Now he's mad at me, I am mad at him too for not understanding my side too. So who's right? Not the asshole lama the comments are insane. Being a K-pop fan and interested in the culture is one thing, being creepily obsessive and fetishizing Koreans is a whole other thing. She may not have been malicious about it but she needs to learn that this is not acceptable behavior and it's weird now that she's young. Not that it is Op's job to do this but damn. Not the asshole. From the title I assumed something different, but no she makes you into a racial trope, which is not okay. Not the asshole. The biggest thing that concerns me is that they aren't trying to correct her on certain things and to help her understand what behavior is okay and what isn't. She is the way she is because her family isn't trying to help her appreciate the culture and learn that she can ask questions and be interested without offending others. She's 13. He's acting like she's seven or something. It sounds like you were racially objectified, and it's valid that you're not okay with it. Not the asshole, because nobody gets to tell you what you find racist against yourself. If they aren't of Korean decent, they have no say in the matter. Not the asshole. If people had to be fully aware that what they are doing is racist for it to count as racism, then no one would ever be called out and nothing would ever change. I'm confused how some people in the comments here can be so obtuse, equating speaking Korean to someone solely because of their race to speaking Korean to someone who you know speaks fluent Korean and grew up in Korea. If you're not seeing a difference there, you don't want to see the difference. I'm guessing a lot of you are American going by the comments, as a Scottish person I get asked a lot of these similar questions from Americans about Scotland and Ireland, keep that same energy the next time you want to rant about how you're three Scottish or Irish and asking us a bunch of dumb questions. Out of sheer curiosity, why is calling you unni racist? Info did you tell her that you didn't want to be called unni? Did you tell her that you weren't interested in the dancing? 
Nah, you just gotta talk it out. She's 13 and has a lot of learning to do. She in no way realized how uncomfortable she made you. It also sounds like she thinks you're cool and wants you to think she's cool. I'm sure this stuff gets old for you but it could have been handled better by both you and your boyfriend. I will not be calling an ignorant 13 year old a racist even though she was acting racist, sounds like she was just trying to hard. Edit switched to proper nah. Not the asshole I'm black American and white people do the same things to me sometimes it's really annoying and they don't seem to understand some of their actions although they may not be intentional can be a bit prejudice and racist. Not the asshole. Her behavior was racist, but many people don't have a proper understanding of what racism is to appreciate that. It's weird seeing people trying to justify this behavior. As a black dude it seems no different than someone assuming I rap and grew up in the hood etc and it's hard to not feel like someone making those assumptions is in some way racist. Even if they didn't mean anything in a negative way, if someone just met me and immediately started asking me if I knew any rappers and asked for me to start freestyling I'd be pretty uncomfortable. Not the asshole. Nada. It is such a weird behavior. And the people saying er to are definitely not subject of racism. It's very ignorant behavior to call a Korean person like that, and the assumptions she made were very racist. You're the arsehole H. She's 13 years old. And is fascinated and interested in Korean culture. She finally got to hang out with a Korean girl. I'm sure she was annoying as all get out but she was probably super excited. I think I'd maybe say nah. You were absolutely being racially objectified, but I wouldn't be surprised if your boyfriend and her sister are totally unaware of why that behavior was racist and what the context around a lot of it is. It doesn't make it okay, but a conversation about it might be helpful. But then again it shouldn't be your job to educate people on their racist behavior so, person shrugging, fair skin. There's a difference between ignorance and racism. I think she said you look like an idol because she thinks you're pretty. Sorry to burst the Reddit race bubble but this is not racism. The sister is a child. More proof that people on Reddit have zero emotional and social intelligence. Ignorance racism. Oh no, the sister is one of those really cringy career boos huh? So my read on the sister is an obsessive fangirl with no regard for your personal boundaries. I've been in a lot of fandoms over the years and believe me, I've seen a lot of people especially 13 year girls get really really obsessed with literally anything. I do think it's weird that your boyfriend knows she's like this and expects you to put up with it instead of telling her to stop. I think your boyfriend is tar in this situation. Korean guy here who's dealt with being asked if he's in K-pop for most of his life lmong. Not the asshole. 